fasting is becoming a popular lifestyle choice. So now what is fasting? Fasting means refraining from food from a particular time, okay? So we all know in this part of the world, we have religious fast, you know, you can just decide to, you know, fast for different reasons. Fasts don't last forever. And between fasting periods, you will add foods back into your routine, thus breaking your fast. What is intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting is an eating pattern that alternates periods of eating with periods of either not eating or taking the minimal calories. It emphasizes when you eat rather than what you eat. Even though it has recently gained mainstream attention, intermittent fasting isn't new. People have practiced periods of fasting throughout history, such as for spiritual, health, or survival reasons. The intent of intermittent fasting isn't necessarily only to restrict calories, but also to allow your body to focus on maintenance and recovery rather than digesting. Many fasting patterns incorporate regular 12 to 16 hour periods of fasting into each day, while others include fasting for 24 or 48 hours once or twice per week. When you fast, your body undergoes a number of metabolic changes. After some time, fasting causes your body to enter ketosis, a state in which fat is used for energy when carbohydrates are unavailable. Some foods and beverages you can consume while fasting. Water. Plain or carbonated water contains no calories and will keep you hydrated during a fast. Coffee and tea. This should mostly be consumed without added sugar, milk or cream. However, some people find that adding small amounts of milk or fat can curb hunger. Diluted apple cider vinegar. Some people find that drinking 1-2 to two teaspoons of apple cider vinegar mixed into water can help them stay hydrated and prevent cravings during a fast. Examples of what to eat to break your fast. Smoothie. Blended fruit and juice can be a gentler way to introduce nutrients to your body since they contain less fiber than all raw fruit and vegetables. Dried fruit and nuts. Dates are a concentrated source of nutrients frequently used to break fast in places like Saudi Arabia. Apricots, raisins and nuts may have similar effect. Fermented foods. Try unsweetened yogurt. Fermented foods are a natural source of probiotics, which are the beneficial bacteria that inhabit your gut microbiome. By fortifying your gut microbiome, eating fermented foods after a fast can help improve the digestibility of other food that you eat subsequently. Healthy fats. Foods like boiled eggs or avocados can be great first food to eat after a fast. Banana. Bananas are one of the best fruits to eat after fasting because they are also rich in electrolytes like potassium and magnesium and are high in carbohydrates while being gentle on the stomach. No fruit is quite like it. Banana substitutes are hard to find. In summary, try to eat slowly and in small quantities to gently guide your digestive tract back into operation without overwhelming your body or doing all of the hard work from your fast. It can be easy to overeat between fasting periods. Although fasting doesn't emphasize what you eat as much as when you eat, it's not designed to be an excuse to eat unhealthy foods. Overeating and eating junk food between fasting periods can cancel out the health benefits of fasting. Instead, choose minimally processed whole foods as much as possible for the most overall health benefits.